Are you green fingered? My mum was a huge plant lady, so much so that she used to take a little plastic sandwich bag in her pocket and if she saw a plant that she liked, she might just take a little bit and put it in the bag so that she could propagate it at home. Um, sometimes it made me a bit concerned because I was like, is that stealing? Is it stealing? I don't know, but yeah, she seemed to be so good at that. Like she literally had green fingers. She could make anything grow from the tiniest little piece. And I think now, you know, I, I didn't appreciate it at the time, but I think now I wish that we could have had more time together and that she could have taught me more of what she knew about how to look after plants. I certainly did not inherit her skills. <laughs> um, my, yeah, my gardening skills are yeah, significantly lacking in comparison. For today's journaling exercise, I thought we'd maybe do something a little bit different and something that might also spark our imaginations. So we are going to write today about what we'd be if we were a plant. If you had to describe yourself as a specific plant, tree, flower or other living thing in nature, what would you choose and why? Get creative with this metaphor for your physical well-being. Now, if you're not a plant person, you could also maybe have a think about, well, what do plants need to thrive and use that analogy to write about your own physical well-being. So things like water, sunlight, nutrients, space, um, lack of competition. There's, there's quite a few different analogies that you could think about there. When I was thinking about this prompt, rather than thinking about myself, I like automatically thought about my mum. So this exercise might also make you think about other people and what they mean to you. You know, it's, it's up to you to interpret the writing prompt uh, the way that helps you, I guess. The things that you're drawn to are correct. So like I always say, there's no, there's no right way to do this and how you interpret things is actually part of the magic because we're all different. So if you're thinking about other people, perhaps you might think about what plants remind you of them, what qualities uh, remind you of them um, or make you think of them. My task today, I guess, is a bit more difficult because I'm not sure I can choose just one plant for my mom. <laughs> uh, that might be quite difficult, but I think it'll be really nice to write about. Um, yeah, so thank you for spending the morning with me again and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow for more journaling.